Hi guys, it's Raghav and uh, welcome only for automation. Today I will share some uh, important information on the interview point of view and it's about very first line which uh, plays a vital role in automation which is a web driver driver equal to new chrome driver or firefox driver or uh, internet explorer driver so here i will tell you the concept of uh, this line and here many points and questions will be covered like uh, overriding and uh, runtime polymorphism and uh, what happened i don't if i don't write uh, the web driver we'll see so first uh, i like to tell you about the web driver and uh, i'll not tell you the complex definition which is written in websites uh, so web driver is a collection of open source apis which are used to automate the web application and it's an interface guys it's an interface it's not a class so and all these uh, classes classes here we can see the classes uh, web driver is a class uh, firefox uh, web driver is not a class firefox driver is a class and chrome driver is a class internet uh, explorer is a class so it's an interface and uh, interface uh, is implemented by the class only so guys uh, i have uh, some questions that uh, why we don't write uh, web driver driver equal to new web driver and uh, um, why we want prefer firefox driver equal to new firefox driver chrome driver uh, driver equal to new chrome driver why we write web driver driver equal to new firefox driver so we will cover in this video so guys let's see guys uh, web driver is an interface so we cannot create the object of an interface so if any interviewer asks you about that uh, why web driver is an interface then you must tell that it's an interface so we cannot create the object and for class we can create object so like uh, you can see the error is also coming because it's an interface so you cannot create the object for that so now you have to create a chrome driver now i'm writing chrome driver equal to new chrome driver so now it's working fine because uh, the object are same of the class which like the reference variable is driver now the chrome driver is a class and the object also we are creating the same means the new chrome driver and we are passing the object of chrome driver so here uh, how many means all these uh, methods will get only from chrome driver means we cannot it's like a it's not a runtime polymorphism it's like compile time polymorphism because it will be constant means uh, our method will be execute only cro on chrome driver not a, uh, not a will execute on firefox or internet explorer because it will be constant or a static for chrome driver and uh, similarly if i uh, if i type uh, what firefox driver it's firefox driver equal to new firefox driver you can write you can write but it's not a good practice like if an uh, interviewer asks you that uh, you need to execute multi uh, your test cases on multiple browser then you cannot uh, uh, execute that test cases on multiple browsers because you have only one driver instance so we cannot uh, we should not create a reference variable for a specific uh, firefox driver or uh, any chrome driver so that uh, we should create uh, uh, we should create a reference variable for an interface so we are creating a uh, reference variable for interface so we have multiple methods in firefox driver but with the definition but uh, but you all know that uh, interface what is the interface interface uh, contains only the signature of the uh, methods only the methods name and uh, with, with with the parameters so here we we have all these methods and 
while we are calling the methods we are overriding the methods which is uh, which is inside the firefox driver class so means we are giving the body of uh, firefox driver class methods but we have the name same similar name we have multiple similar name in this uh, multiple classes like uh, we have a interface interface uh, the same name which is also exist in the firefox driver class or chrome driver class or ie driver class so like uh, it's a runtime polymorphism when you call this it will it will change on runtime and it will override all these methods on runtime and it will call the methods of firefox java according to the object it will changed okay yeah so you can you can say to the interviewer that uh, it's a runtime polymorphism okay so this body is very small and uh, Uh, it's a very important question and it's a very important interview question we can say because uh, i faced many interviews and uh, most of all these interviewer asked this question means uh, uh, where you have uh, 